don't forget these three things next time you're practicing for your oskis in this video we'll focus on the cardiac exam so when it comes to the cardio exam we all remember that you have to listen to the heart in four different places use the bell and the diaphragm and you have to feel you have to palpate thrills and heaves thrills with three fingers heaves with the palm of your hand but don't forget the apex beat it's in the fifth intercostal space midclavicular line there's a bunch of pulses you want to feel for the radial the brachial the delay the femoral delay all of that when it comes to the neck and feeling for the carotid when you're doing jvp the bed has to be at 45 degrees depending on if the patient's really healthy or not very healthy they might be sat completely right up because some patients can't breathe when they're lying flat i always forget to do this don't forget to listen to the base of the lungs for crackles it does feel a bit weird to do it because it's literally the cardio exam it's not the lung exam but a lot of patients with heart failure might have crackles at the base of their lungs try and link it in for when you're feeling for sacral edema just think you're looking for edema at the base of their back and also at the base of their lungs make sure to follow so you don't miss out on our don't forget series we're going to be posting a bunch of tips and advice on all the commonly forgotten things in your oski exams